Ladies and gentlemen, this is a real F-35 right here. Listen to this right now. In this video, I'm going to show you both the F-35 and the new F-86F Sabre. Echo 19 does both of their sound packages, okay? I am not here to put Echo 19 down. I am not here to put them down, but their flybys are from a distance. From a distance, they're not too bad. Listen to this and then listen to when it gets close. So as you can see, that wasn't too bad. That sounds good as it gets farther away. The issue with Echo 19, and I don't think it's them. I think it's actually the, the India Fox Techo and the actual producers of the planes. They have this horrific whistle sound. Now listen, we're going to go close up. From a distance, which they're filming their videos from a distance, it sounds all right. Listen to this close up. You'll hear the whistle sound again like a Jetson jet. So that's what's compromising the whole entire sound package. And the sound package is a little delayed, as you saw, was delayed to catch up. That is because that's an aerial sound package they're attaching. It's not the actual sound, I believe, of the F-35, the actual plane. When it goes by, and so does the India Fox Techo F-14, that whistle sound has got to go. It has got to go. It's atrocious. It's ruining these great jets, guys. I'm not here to shit on Echo 19. I'm really thankful that these guys are trying. I'm not being a jerk. I'm not being egotistical or anything. The reason I say send everything to me is because I, that this would never happen. I would, I would tell you right away and tell these folks right away, you can't release this like this. We have to get it fully right. Now, here's the F-86 F uh, Sabre. They do the sound package as well as that. The, the sounds for this plane are actually better than the F-35, and Echo 19 does both this and the F-35. Listen to this take off from a distance. So it's not too bad at all. I really, really love this jet, by the way. I really love this jet. And these sounds are close, guys. They're close. The issue that I'm pointing out and that I want Echo 19, I'm trying to give constructive criticism, guys. I want the finest, no bullshit here, the finest for myself and for everybody. Five out of ten doesn't work in my world for all you haters out there that just say, be happy or stop bitching. No, we are out to strive for the best for these jets. Listen to this flyby. So as you can see, it's so close, guys. It just has that crazy whistle of a vacuum slash mini space shuttle. I have no idea for the life of me why they are doing that. I, I can't figure out who makes those calls. I'm not being a jerk, guys. That whistle has got to go. It's on plane after plane after plane. I don't even care for DC designs, guys. They they've gotten on my bad side as of recent. But I'm gonna not gonna I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm based on my feelings. Their sounds are phenomenal. They're phenomenal everywhere. Check this out.
So I think I've made my point here, guys. And all the Echo 19 videos, I watched every single one right before I made this video. They're flying from a distance, from a distance. It just depends on what you demand in life, guys. I don't drive a Honda Civic. I drive a freaking C8 Corvette. I am out for the best. I'm not being egotistical. I'm not being Mr. Chauvinistic, a jerk, nothing. I'm out to strive for the absolute best. I'm passionate about this stuff, guys. It's not coming from a point of negativity or judgment, even though it may come across as that. I want the shit done right. And I know these guys can do it, and I know they're capable. Let's rise up and get it done. That should not have passed. And that's why I say forget everybody else in the game. Send everything to me. I won't let you guys down. I just won't allow it. Send everything to me. And I will freaking go on there, and I will test every way possible. And by the time it gets to you guys, it'll be refined. I will simply not allow anything less. That's all my channel's about. That's my whole life about. Am I the absolute best on earth? No, as a person. No, I'm not better than Michael Jordan at basketball, anything like that. The point is you strive. You strive to the best, guys, to the absolute best, okay? So that's what I wanted to make a video on to clarify. The, the, the Echo 19 videos, they're all from a distance. They're not close-up flybys like I'm doing. If you don't do flybys, it might not affect you too bad. But this needs to be ironed out in that whistle from the F-35, the F-14, and even the, uh, what was the new one that just came out that I love? Oh, the Tornado. It, it's ruining the Jets, guys. It's ruining the Jets. You have to get that whistle sound out. And to be honest with you, the F-35 is a thunderous roar. It just it just doesn't sound good, guys. It's not the worst. I do realize this is a video game slash simulation. I understand that. I know these guys are doing their best. But these jets are a roar, and in my opinion, and I'm dead right, I'm absolutely right, DC Designs has captured it in terms of jets, the absolute best in the game right now, okay? The absolute best, DC Designs has captured the closest, at least their jets roar when they go by. There's not a whole lot to say, guys. Nobody can disagree with this shit. If you do, go ahead. There's a lot of keyboard warriors out there, a lot of little haters, fanboys out there that just throw missiles at it. That's fine. But I wanted to make this video to show my point and that they make the uh, the sounds for both the Sabre and the F-35. And that's what you're seeing. That's why on the videos, because I rewatched the videos and they sound pretty damn good. It's because it's from a distance. The closer you get to that jet, that whistle appears and it's it destroys the integrity of the jet. Uh, the jet. No jet in the history of mankind has had a vacuum whistle ever. I rest my case later.